both sides of the decimal point are an odd number. Mm. It's not 16. Oh. It's not 17. Mm. Dorsey, give me another guess. Uh, uh, 18. I said odd. I said odd. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Both sides of the decimal point. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Both That's sides of the decimal point are 19. odd number. Go both, below 16. Both numbers. both numbers are odd? Yes, go below 16. <laughs> go below. Okay, let's do uh, 14, 14, 21. As you can see, I've got one, two, three, four. I've got five envelopes right here. These are from the Screen Actors Guild. And these are checks that I get from time to time. I've done some acting in my day. I heard. Yeah, yeah? Yeah. I've done uh, some films. I've done some uh, TV shows, um, commercials. Yeah. Did some adult films I'm not mm -hmm. proud of. And they have to pay you yep. huh, no. when they do these. No. And they're called residual checks. I don't know how much they're for. I don't know what they're for. But I figured we'd make a game out of it. I'm going to open up one of these checks. I'll let you choose which one. I don't know which one. I'm not opening them. He'll pick it. I'll open it. I'll tell everybody what it's for and how it's airing. And the closest one to the amount wins the game. If you get it exactly right, I'll give you the check. <laughs> it's a game that we like to call <clears throat> how, how Much Is That, that Screen Actors Guild Residual? Nailed it. Wow. So, I'm going to pick one. Yeah. And for all the naysayers out there, I see some comments every once in a while that yeah, I don't you know. do not open these I don't up. open them. They're not, I don't pick them. I don't open them. I sit on these. Yep. And here's another reason. I know these amounts are usually ridiculous. Ridiculously low. So I'm not in a hurry to open them. Oh, you're, you don't need the $13. So I don't, you know, it, I don't know what it is. But sometimes they're not. Sometimes they're big. You choose this one? I'm choosing this one, sir. All right. Let's crack her open. I feel like you should make your intern do this, but I don't want him to. Let's anyways. come again to come up. Yeah, is, is your intern uh, Marcus Stamos close by? Mark, does can he you come wanna, to the? Does he want to crack this up? And I feel can like you come open to Mark. Yeah, th you have to tell him what to do. Mark, I mean, yeah, Mark, can you come open this check, sir? I don't tell him. Just kidding. Door's locked. I need oh, you to stay out. That's okay. Go on we'll now. Get, we'll get in there. It's I'm not sorry. your week. I, I can, it's your, your next that. week. <laughs> I'll, I, sorry. Stamos, we set that old thing up. That was fun. <laughs> I love Marcus Stamos. That was a fun little joke. We locked you out. And we had a camera on the door. <laughs> <laughs> the door cam. The old it's door cam, new. dude. You walked right into it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is great. Oh, man. You should be All right. I got some money here. Okay. This is one check uh, for an episode of One Mississippi. Oh, yeah. The episode was called Light of Love. Now, have you seen? Have we talked about this? One Mississippi? Is that the. It was on Amazon Prime. Mm. Tig Notaro, comedian. She had her own show oh. called One Mississippi. Mm. And I played a uh, her uh, brother's. What was it? Her brother's best friend from college. And I was also a Civil War reenactor. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. And so this is for one episode of that uh, for paid television. Sebastian, how much is this? Check sixteen dollars. What? Go ahead. And forty six cent. Okay, see, this is also like a poker game because I want people watching this to have time to re to to adjust their guess to my reaction to his guess. Yes. Did you see what I did when you said your guess? You were shocked in all. Shock and all. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> all right. D. Allen Jackson, are you writing that down? Okay. How many people do we have on hold? Uh, a lot. <laughs> Let's roll them. Well, then I don't know if we let these guys in there play. Uh, quickly. quickly. Isaiah, what's your guess? $65 and... 59 cents. 
Notice the reaction. What's wrong with this kid? At least he Did went he not high. just see my reaction oh, to you? He's young. He's lo- uh, lock him in, dude. Yeah, that's, that's it. it. He said sixty-five. I did. Yeah, either one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just blurted something out. Quiet. Elliot. 1712. Mm. All right. Does uh, Stamos want to play as long as he's on that side? He can play. <laughs> he's not, he's not approaching he's us at all. Right? <laughs> he's pissed. <laughs> all right. Let's go to phone lines. All right. Let's see what your guess is. J- John Reap here. You're on the phone. Who am I talking to? This is your friend Roseanne Henshaw from Virginia Beach, Virginia. Roseanne Henshaw. <laughs> Roseanne Henshaw. <laughs> Thank you, Elliot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I Rose. was so honored that you had chose me or my little segment than when we first talked to being on the best of the 2020 show. I saw her, heard it, and looked at it, watched it. I thought that was so sweet of you. Well, Thank you, you earned so it, much. Roseanne. You earned that title because that was the hardest I've ever <laughs> laughed on the show, <laughs> yeah. and um, that was 2020. And now we're here. Here we are in 2021. We're still talking, and yeah. uh, I appreciate yeah. you calling back in. I hope you had a good New Year. Oh, it was quiet. No bird but, noises. Um, I learned. Uh, I did. It was kind of quiet, but I mean, it was, and watching the TV was a little boring. But uh, mm. I learned one thing. <laughs> That if I mean, or at least I learned one thing is if you're, if, if you, basically if your cat purrs when he sees you naked, does that make him a pervert? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I I, I just want to give her the chance. <laughs> I just want to give ahead. it to her. All right, Rose, <laughs> thank you. That was perfect. <laughs> um, what's your guess? Yeah, basic. Um, my guess is uh, forty six dollars and ninety six cents. Okay, all righty, lock her in at that. What? Uh, so you're on the show with John Reap. Who am I talking to? Johnny Dorsey. Dorsey, what's up, Dorsey? What's happening, buddy? Thanks for calling in, brother. Uh, you're the last one. You've been paying attention. I hope. What's a good guess? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Go for it. All righty. I'm going to say 1702. 1702. All right. That is the – it's there. it. All right. So let me just tell you, the closest winner was Mr. Sebastian. There we go. Okay. You got the closest. He Listen, got the I'm closest with you. his guess. Because everyone else went too high. I'm on a feast curve, brother, not a famine curve right now. I've got a, a fantasy football championship. I got nine point two million dollars, and I'm getting ready to win sixteen dollars. What was my guess again, Alan? Well, you, you, your guess was not right. It was just the closest. Okay. Closest. Yeah. Yeah. Right. But I'm gonna get it right right now. No. No. no oh, okay. Was, I'm gonna just buy. I'll give you sixteen dollars because they were so good. But I want to get a listener. Okay. A chance to win. I don't blame you. Listener. The closest, like the closest listener. listener. Let's get a. Right, let's on. get the closest listener. Do you know who that is? Without, I, I knew right right out the gate when you said sixteen. I started going like, I, I do. I've got the closest listener. If you want it. All right. Let's reveal who that person is. Right, the closest listener. And now are they still on the phone? Um. Yeah, got, they oh, are. Okay. Mm-hmm. Good. Yep. Who we got? It's uh, Dorsey. Dorsey. All right. Let's bring Dorsey. He's back. Dorsey is back on the phone with us. You got? Did I reveal the amount? No, no you have yet. not. Okay. Giving him a Dorsey's I was going to say that ruins the whole game. Dorsey, if I <laughs> Dorsey's guess was seventeen oh two. My you're... guess was sixteen forty six. Yep. Okay, Dorsey, I'm going to give you another chance at this check, and I want you. All right. Um, is you want me to give you if it's an even number or if it's an odd number? Or do you want this to be uh, – I don't know how else we could do it. I mean, do you want to just knock off the chain? No. All right. Choose even or odd. Dorsey. Odd. Odd? Yes, sir. Okay, you're right. It is an odd number. Both sides of the decimal point are an odd number. Mm. It's not 16. Oh. It's not 17. Mm. Dorsey, give me another guess. 
Both sides of the decimal point. I'm sorry. See. How are, um, Both sides weird. of the decimal point are 19. odd number. Go both, below 16. Both numbers. both numbers are odd? Yes, go below 16. <laughs> go below, okay, let's do uh, 14, 14, 21. Are you watching this live right now, Dorsey? <laughs> are you seeing my face? Yes, I am. <laughs> Man, yes, I am. Dorsey. Okay, I, I, I thank you for calling in, man. I I wanted you to win this, but I said I told you to guess Come odd on, twice, and both times you gave me an even number. <laughs> uh, an odd number is like a prime number. Um, can't be divisible by two. I think that's the definition of an odd number. I I don't know. But I, the first time I told you an odd number, you said um, you went eighteen. Yep. Then and went, then I said, no, 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 odd number. Yeah. Then you went 14. <laughs> Can you give me something between a 14 and an 18 that's an odd number and is below 17. 16 <laughs> and 17? <laughs> please, uh, please, Dorsey. You said not do 15. What? You said What's don't 15? do 15. Do, yeah. Do, no, no, no. I'll, no, no, I'll, I'll try. I'll great. shoot for that. Go, go for 15 point and then another odd number after it. 15 or 3. That's a very close guess. Is it? $15.13. Better, Ten luck, cent better off. luck next time, Dorsey. That, that's what I said, but I left out the one, John. That's, not what that, he said. that's that Roanoke River map. We got you. That's that Roanoke River map, man. Come on. We got you recorded, Dorsey. <laughs> we'll review the tape. <laughs>